Well, Mr. Chairman, let me sincerely thank you for putting this uh, amendment uh, uh, on block to designate a guaranteed amount of funds authorized in the bill to be sent directly to the Kurdish Peshmerga. Now, throughout the years, the Kurds have been bombed by Turkey, uh, executed by Iran, gassed by Iraq, besieged by Syria, and now they are being hunted on a daily basis by ISIS thugs who have gone well beyond war crimes and crimes against humanity. For months, the world sat back and watched as ISIS raped, murdered, beheaded, crucified, burned people alive, and perpetrated genocide against innocent Christians, Yazidis, and other religious minorities. From day one, the Peshmerga of the Kurdish regional government has consistently stood bravely and often alone in the fight against these evil monsters of ISIS. They are the only paramilitary democracy in the Middle East besides Israel that holds the ideals that we do, recognizing the rights of all religious minorities, including the Christians and Yazidis, who they have defended with their lives. Uh, Mr. Chairman, the Peshmerga are some of the most well-trained, cohesive, and determined fighters against ISIS that we have in Iraq. They have proven to be the only effective ground force to resist and push back ISIS. With minimal means and U.S. coalition support, the Kurdish Peshmerga has successfully resisted the full force of ISIS along a 600-mile front. They have persistently worked to drive out ISIS from Iraq without pursuing a territorial gain for themselves. And they are now poised to launch an offensive against entrenched ISIS positions at Mosul and cut off their retreat. To be successful, Peshmerga and the KRG desire to work with and lead Sunni Arab tribesmen, tribesmen with the American military training uh, and weapons. Yet they are outmanned, outgunned, and they are in need of effective night vision, um, armored vehicles, heavy artillery, body, body armor, radios and assault rifles, among the other types of military equipment. Last November, Mr. Chairman, Congress passed an omnibus appropriations that included $1.6 billion in the Iraqi Train and Equip Fund. Language in the bill clearly delineated that funds for assistance, including equipment, should go to Kurdish forces. Yet KRG Minister of Foreign Relations, Fala Mustafa, recently stated that, quote, hardly any made in USA equipment has arrived. Mr. Chairman, the Kurds are our friends, but this administration seems to be hanging them out to dry, and I am grateful this committee is not standing by idly as well. I look forward to working with the chairman on this measure through the conference to uh, support the Peshmerga so that they can continue to protect their homeland and continue to fight against one of the greatest evils this world has ever seen. And with that, Mr. Chairman, I yield the remainder of my time.